so here we are halfway through season one on Tour of Giving, and we thought we'd take a moment to recap some of the amazing stories we've seen thus far. Take a look. To people pursuing their passions for a positive purpose. It started out to be a mission about food for us, but it turned out to be more a mission about food and love for people and helping people get back on their feet. The way this got started is we just kind of fell into it. We were wanting to uh, make beautiful images and we also wanted to help out some rescue organizations and it felt like we could use our resources to make that happen. To everyday people doing extraordinary things. People that out there willing, ready to give up hope. I would say, don't give up, because there's angels is right around the corner, ready to pick you up and to, to reach out to you. But sometimes we have to reach, we got to reach back. We got to reach back and receive your blessings. But someone is out there ready to help you. Just don't give up. to individuals who are turning tragedy into triumph. If it's an encouraging word I can give to someone or some type of knowledge or skill that I can share um, to help them along their journey in life, to me that's like one of the most rewarding things that you can get out of life is to help somebody else. Um, a lot of times you may not receive acknowledgement or you know admonition for it, but it's its own personal reward, I think. People are gonna try to tear you down. You'll have people that tell you that you can't do it, but those are the people you gotta learn how to ignore and just keep pushing towards what it is you wanna do. And for me, it's been my artwork. To people who are making a living giving, I was encouraged a long time ago because of the way I was brought up. It doesn't matter what you have or what you don't have, uh, there's always somebody worse off than yourself. No matter if it was medical problems or job problems and the way the economy is these days, everybody needs a handout or at least a hand up. And I, all I ask is, is most of us is, is open your eyes, open your heart and open your wallet if you can. It's very simple. There's a lot of people out there that need extra shoes or even a, a, a nice shirt or a tie to get them through a job interview. Everybody has something to share if we just stop and think, and that's the way I feel. To folks who found a way to turn their hobbies into helping. It just feels good to see everybody working together and uh, you know it'd be so beautiful if everyone could do that for each other. We wouldn't have as much need in the world, you know, we, we feel like, you know, we've, um, I don't know the word I want to use, but it, it's like in your heart you just feel so good because you've done something beautiful for someone else. And without asking anything in return, you're just helping each other. To men and women who are helping the next generation, I think the thing that's most important is that you just do something. If you put yourself out there and show the younger generation that you're human too, that not every adult is just an authority to be reckoned with and a force that has to be pushed against, that you were young, you have faults, you have things to offer, you make mistakes. The most humbling experience at Thursday Boys is coming out as an adult and having a third or fourth grader put you out at dodgeball. You know, and you're throwing hard and they're throwing hard and it's just a very equalizing experience. And I think it's important for adults to get out, get involved in whatever they can do. And typically these things just kind of work themselves out. And finally, our next generation of givers as we saw today. People everywhere are making a difference giving, and there's a lot we can learn from them. And while the stories may be different, the message is always the same. 
We don't always know the difference we make when we're giving, but we always make a difference. So keep on giving. If you or someone you know is making a difference by giving, we want to know about it. Send your stories and videos to stories at tourofgiving.com.